Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday on the 22nd of July, Microsoft rolled out this week's latest beta channel inside a preview build, 22635.3936. Now, I didn't post on that beta flight because it didn't really have that too many front-facing features to uh, mention for the purpose of a video. But um, there has been a hidden feature that's been spotted uh, in this week's latest beta channel build. And once again, it's been spotted by Phantom of Earth over on X, where the toggle for tailored experiences in settings is going to be replaced with personalized offers, as we can see, and move to the general privacy and security settings page. So it's basically getting a refresh with a new name and some visual updates, but basically is doing the same thing. So personalized offers means get personalized tips, ads, and recommendations based on my Windows activity. Now, just to put this all into kind of context, um, if we head back to the stable version of Windows 11, where you find tailored experiences, uh, it's part of the privacy and security, and you head down to diagnostics and feedback and yeah you get tailored experiences which i've turned off let microsoft use your diagnostic data for personalized tips ads and recommendations so this is what we are speaking about so this is getting a bit of a rename to personalized offers and microsoft is moving it from diagnostics and feedback to the general section on the privacy and security page so it'll be yeah right at the top and just on a side note, as I've mentioned in previous videos, if you want to see less so-called ads or advertising or notifications and banners, uh, try undoing most of these uh, settings on this page, including tailored experiences. And uh, so that's kind of putting it into context for you. And as mentioned, that's going to get renamed to personalized offers where it says, I get personalized tips, ads, and recommendations. That's the same, but the change is based on my Windows activity. So that little description has changed and it's now called personalized offers. It's a hidden feature. So this is code that Microsoft could be working on internally and hasn't enabled yet in the OS. But although I don't use this feature and have it turned off anyway in the stable version, where it's now known, uh, where it's still known, sorry, as tailored experiences, I think personalized offers if you are using this feature for, for whatever reason, makes a little bit more sense when it comes to the name now of the actual toggle and the description for the setting. So I don't see why Microsoft wouldn't roll that out um, for official testing, but just putting it out there and thought you may be interested. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.